I mean, if your team wins, your team wins. That's how it works. Uh, extradited to Bulgaria? Wants to know, why do you drive in third person? I drive in third person because I feel it gives me a better sense of what's around me than uh, mirrors. Since I'm not physically here in a physical place, maybe with a VR helmet and actually able to look left and right, um, I've, I've, I've always found that driving in third person is easier and have a better sense of what, Like, I feel like if I'm driving a real car, I have a decent sense of my surroundings, but I don't feel that way. I feel like it compensates for audio cues, visual cues, uh, all sorts of other aspects that are missing out. That's the same reason I, I, I'm okay with, like, third-person action games. Because in third-person action games, like, I extrapolate my ability to see around me is accounting for some of the awareness stuff that comes from the real world that video games just can't do. Um, okay, didn't ask for the life story. Okay. Surrounded by simulator is supposed to be serious. First person is serious gameplay. I mean, everybody plays video games differently, and I am not playing the game wrong, if that's what you're trying to say. I'm playing it like I'm playing it. Alright. Let's see here. We're gonna try working... Uh, I need to practice with my articulated trailers, but I don't have one right now. You're cheating, kind of? I'm not cheating, kind of. You know, the game when the game runs an automobile into me and finds me because that car hits me, that's the game cheating, okay? When I run a red light by accident and there's nobody around to see it and I get a fine, that's the game cheating. That's not realistic. The game doesn't penalize your pride is damaged. You have no pride. What do you... What? Who do you think you're talking to? <laughs> Oh my god. What you wouldn't happening? defend your country in a war? <laughs> what do you mean I wouldn't defend my... I wouldn't get into a war for my country. I don't believe in the reason my country goes to war. I don't think we should go sack other countries and take their oil. Which is I'm mostly starting, the reason we go to war. To feed, you're starting to feed the troll. I mean... I, trolls can starve to death for all I care. Does it matter if I agree or not? Yeah, it does. Uh, do, 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 do. Love for the country always. Love for the government when it deserves it. My dude, are you really in here in a truck game talking about that shit? Yep, they are. I don't get why people do that. What's my opinion on January 6th? It was a failed insurrection proposed by the previous uh, president of the United States who was elected fairly and squarely as was the current president of the United States elected fairly and squarely. And, um, and it should be pretty apparent that we had a criminal president doing criminal things who tried to do a coup and it failed. So yay that time, but maybe not the next time. Oh, is that really what happened? You so sure about that? Yes, I am so sure about that. I'm sorry, what is this mute icon you have next to your name, Extradited? I'm in, I'm curious, what is this? Watching, Watching without, without audio? audio? What the hell? You, didn't you vote for Trump in 2016? No. I voted for Bernie Sanders. And then I reluctantly, I think I voted for Hillary Clinton in the prime, in the in the general election. Well, what I don't understand, Captain Soja, if they can't hear me, how are they responding to what I'm saying? Why am I... I'm not a lot... First of all... First of all, there were reasons that people could have voted for Trump in 2016. Anybody who voted for Trump in 2016, I don't have any, like, super harsh feelings towards you. I, I get that there are some reasons you could have been fooled into voting for Trump. You voted for him in 2020, that's a different story. All right, we're, we're past that, all right? <laughs> the, the reasons are gone. It 
It's an icon they can choose to actually mute it. Oh, okay. Um, but I didn't vote for Trump. No, I voted for Bernie Sanders. I voted for Bernie Sanders in both elections, and he, in, in my, I mean, he almost won 2016, and he got very close to winning in 2020, closer than people realize, because the establishment Democrats, they went against him. Um, my banner on Facebook still says Bernie would have won across the top, so... I just think you shouldn't be playing serious European game. There is a game for Americans to play if you don't want to be serious. Okay, now you're trolling. Now we all know with 100% certainty <laughs> that you're just trolling. <laughs> and you're hilarious. And you're cute. And it's beautiful. I love it. Good effort. Um, please consider following the channel and voting in the poll. Let me give it to you here. You can do it It's uh, for what games you'd like to see. If you want to see me play American Truck Simulator... It's doing well in the poll right now. You could vote for it. And then maybe, unlike the American elections, your vote will matter. Oh, God. Having said that, for anybody who might be watching sometime later on YouTube, I want to thank you for watching. This has been Euro Truck Simulator 2. I have been Huntermun. I'm her guest, Malcolm Fett. And we will see you in the future gonna be a great outro what about <laughs> no 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 cutting it off cutting it off <laughs>